Okay, my dudes, what is up? Today, we can see a whole bunch of Beyblades right here. This is what I think was the pinnacle, the top of the best of the best of all the evolutions, the God Evolution, man. I, guys, in my opinion, the God Evolution was one of the best. Comment down below which evolution for you was the best in the whole generation. Me, I'm going God Evolution. I love the anime. I love the Beyblades. They're awesome battles. This is when the gimmicks started to come in. The gimmicks were not too crazy. They still did burst. Because once we started getting into like Cho Z and GT and all that stuff, the Beyblades got bigger. The gimmicks got crazier, but the Beyblades somehow started to burst less, taking away the Beyblade burst part of the whole generation, man. So really and truthfully, for me, the first, the second, and the third evolutions were the coolest. Beyblade gods being, for me, the best ones, man. Uh, the single and the dual layers were absolutely epic as well, but this one here, like I said, they, they started to bring some kind of like cool gimmicks like these, or switching a bay from left to right, which is actually really, really awesome. Or we had like the rebound gimmick. Well, this is the strike one. This was the rebound gimmick right here. Gimmicks that were like not too crazy, didn't really work, but we're still cool to have on a bay with epic battles and they still burst. So for me, definitely uh, the God generation, no, sorry, the God evolution from the burst generation was the best. So I wanted to put these Beyblades right here against another Beyblade. And I wanted to do it from the Hasbro brand. So I was thinking to myself, long and hard, which Beyblade can we get from Hasbro to face off against the TT version of the God Evolution? And guys, if you watched the other day, we done a Valtriek only tournament where we took all of the Valtriex and we battled them out in a full on tournament and only one Valtriex came out on top and was the best of the wet best. If you missed that video, stop this right now. Go back and watch it real quick because I'm about to show you who the winner is because the winner from that tournament of the Valtriex only tournament is coming here to face off against these bays. So quickly pause this, go watch the Valtriex only tournament then come back because uh, it's going to be a spoiler. All right, so hopefully you've done that or if you've watched it, you're about to see. This was the winner right here, guys. This Beyblade, the Pro Series from Hasbro. Now you guys can say, yeah, it's a Pro Series. It has got clicks. But let's be honest, even though this has a dash driver, it's got clicks. It's still nowhere near as OP as the uh, TT versions of dash drivers and all that. It still feels weak. Like, look at that guy. Like, that just feels like a normal TT Beyblade. Like, this has a dash driver. Look at that. That's, can you hear that? That's way more stronger with a dash driver than a Pro Series. So I kind of put this one in the same category as this one. So today what we're gonna do, we're gonna find out if the champion, the world champion Pro Series Valtriex from the tournament of only Valtriex can beat all of the bays from the TT Beyblade God Evolution. Let's find out. I have to go guys and get a Valkyrie to go in first. Like it has to just be done, man. All right, first round is here. Let's get into these battles and find out if the Pro Series can destroy all of the gods. Let's do this. Three, two, one, and rip. Okay, guys, we're gonna be doing this in the home stadium of the Pro Series Red Bay. Yo, let's find out if any of these God Bays can defeat it, starting with God of Valkyrie. It's gonna give a good effort, but it can't get a job done. What we're gonna do, guys, is it's gonna just be one battle, because there is so many. But one Beyblade has already been defeated. Let's get the next one in. Three, two, one, and rip. All right, my dude. Oof. Zonda gets knocked out. Let's bring Zack in next. Three, two, one, and rip. Woo! All right, guys, let's put a little bit of stamina, some defense up on the next bay and see if this pro series 
Can defeat him, man. Nice attacks right there. Can Zack be the one? Can that Zeus Beyblade do the job that maybe the other base cannot do? Holy moly, it's gonna be close, but no! He fails right at the end. I cannot believe that. You know what? Let's see if the Stamina King can do it. Three, two, and a rip! All right, guys, put a little bit of stamina on a Beyblade, and let's find out if we can defeat a Pro Series Valtriek champion. Because remember, this was the champion. So it is a champion stadium, a champion battle, but Ragnarok can't get it done! No way! Destroy Driver helping out so bad. All right, guys, Shadow Warrior, come up next. Three, two, and every. All right, my dudes. It's golden. You guys can see it's golden in the center right there. That means it can't burst. It cannot burst when it is gold in the center because it is banged down on there. But are we able to outspin it? I think we might. Shadow Oriaka might be the one to do it, guys. It's going to be so, so close. <laughs> that guy, how close was that right there? All right, that's it. Spin stealing Fafnir's here. Three, two, and every. All right. Oh, it came back in, it's back in, it counts, it's living, it survived. Guys, I played the rules that if it goes in the pocket and it can come out, it burst. It did burst, all right, yeah. If it comes out of the pocket, it, well, do you know what, it doesn't matter, it destroyed it. Can't spin still if you burst. All right, guys, next Beyblade will enter. Three, two, and every. All right, guys, also Kronos is in the stadium now. Can he stop time and get the win against a Pro Series Valtriek? So far, we have all failed, but maybe this is the one. Maybe it takes a Beyblade champion of time to do the job. Here we go, guys. No, we need more stamina, man. All right, let's get Crusaden in. Three, two, one, every. All right, guys, can our defensive powers help us win this battle right now? Woo! Big attacks. The roller wheels on there are actually helping to deflect all them attacks. So we're not going to burst, but we haven't got enough stamina again. No way. Destroy Driver is helping out so good, man. Yo, Blast Genius. I love this play. Three, two, one, every. Oh, Blast Genius is here, the water type bay with a very, very cool gimmick that makes the other bay go off balance. Can it do it against the Pro Series Beyblade now? Not too sure, but it, it burst. Oh, it got destroyed. You know what? It's time to get Luminous in. Three, two, one, every. Okay, my dude, the nightmare is in. Woo! Yo! Smash attacks for days right there. Holy moly. All right, both of them have destroyed drivers, but which one can do it the best, guys? Here we go. Spin stealing is gonna get again a Valtric. This is why he's a world champion, guys. All right, let's get in uh, Kerbius. That's probably gonna burst. Three, two, and every. And here we go, guys. Guardian Kerbius guards nothing because nine times out of 10, he bursts with a couple of hits. Let's, there you go, I told you, what are you guarding when you can't even not guard yourself, man? All right, guys, the big giant frisbee bay, let's do it. Three, two, and every. All right, my dudes, what? No! <laughs> this Beyblade used to be so good, it just got destroyed, it got wrecked, guys, no way. All right, no, 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 I'm getting serious. I'm bringing him Requiem. Three, two, and every. Yo, I told you I'm getting serious, guys. I told you, when we bring Requiem out, it's because now I want to win. That's why we bring Requiem. Requiem is one of the best of the best of the God evolutions. Can we get it? Can Requiem do this for us, guys? It looks like it might. Requiem! No! How, how, guys? Just that tiny bit more, man. All right, Red Eye then. He can maybe do it. Three, two, and every. Oh, well, Requiem almost done it, but uh, Shu being Red Eye is not a good idea because he got destroyed. But now let's find out what Nemesis can do. Three, two, and every. All right, guys, Nemesis with that ultimate reboot might stand a chance if he can knock the Pro Series in the pocket. Yo, I feel like it could not control the power from Ultimate Reboot. Holy moly. All right, guys, the Sofa is here. Three, two, one, hit, rip. And 
Dev Cypher could be the one to get it done. Yo, we're almost so close to knocking these bays out, man, but yo, we need more power. We just need more power, guys, and Dev Cypher is not the one. He goes down. Can Shut the regulars do it? Three, two, on it, rip! All right, my dudes. Shelter Regulus with that tower driver right there. Let's see if the tower can hold it up enough to not, oh no, dude, you can already see it's losing balance. It go burst! No way. Sorry, Shelter Regulus, you have been destroyed, but now beat Kokoken wants some action. Three, two, on it, rip! All right, guys. Beaker Culkin out of every bay. If it was to do it, that would be very, very surprising right there. I love the color of this bay. This teal color is amazing. One of the best color bays ever made, man. All right, here we go, guys. Beaker Culkin does not have enough stamina, but let's find out if Chaos with Bearing can do it. Three, two, one, and rip. All right, guys, so I just realized I'm actually using the Hasbro one because I lost my actual TT version, man. So uh, Hasbro made their way up into here, but it's all good. It could actually maybe do it, but to be honest. Like, no way. If it's a Hasbro brain that does it, what? Are you kidding me, guys? Not only was it chaos, but it was a Hasbro Beyblade that done it. We got a winner. I, I, I cannot believe this. If this is the only Bey to win, that is going to be absolutely insane. All right, guys. Up next is going to be right here, Wyvern. Three, two, one, and rip. And so far, we have only seen a Hasbro Chaos Bey win. <laughs> That's jokes. That is actually jokes right there, guys. All right, here we go, my dudes. Let's see if Wakia can do it with his chain ba blade at Beyblade. He might, he might, he might. He does not. Oh, so close. All right, my dudes. Bahamut is next. Three, two, one, every. And here we go, guys. Let's see if Bahamut can spin steel and win with the atomic drive R. That's a good combination. That's a deadly combination, man. The world champion, Valve Triek, has only lost against one Beyblade, and it was a Hasbro one. That is shocking. All right, guys, here we go. Let's see what's gonna happen right now. It's gonna be very, very, very close, but it will go to a draw. We're not replaying that, so neither of them bays get a win. Now, let's get Toko, Volt's brother. Three, two, one, and rip. All right, guys. Volt couldn't get the job done, but can his brother get the job done? That is the question, guys. Let's see if Toko can do it. Let's see if he can beat the uh, Pro Series champion, guys. It's going to be no way. If Toko does this, guys, this is going to be amazing. Oh, it was so close. All right, we're down to the final Beyblade right now. Volt wants to come in after he's seen his brother couldn't do it again. Let's power him up into Strike God Valkyrie. Three, two, on every. And here we go, guys. Let's see if Strike got. Nope. Strike says no, 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 no. You guys know what that means. The world champion, he drew against Bahama, lost against the Hasbro Chaos but defeated every other bay. All right, guys, he really is a world champion. If you guys want to see more battles like this, hit us up in the comments below. But until then, we'll see you in the next episode. Do yeah.